Hey guys, it's Zero. So, originally I wasn't going to make this video, but um, at a certain point as a person, and more so as a parent, um, you, you get to a point where you just can't take shit anymore. And quite literally, the job that I am working for right now has officially stolen my children's Christmas, and I don't know what to do. Um, let me explain, because there's a lot of details I need to go over to understand what happened exactly. So, the company I work for is a private Catholic tuition-based high school, and I've been working for them since roughly about the beginning of the year, but they do their pay on a, on a um, monthly basis. So it's been tough to budget. I have three children, a wife who has d multiple disabilities that we're currently trying to get disability for, but have been fighting for two years with no luck. So no income there. Um, her mother lives with us. She is disabled, um, rot in the neck, degenerative disc disease in the back, is on disability and does help us. So with that, we have me working and my mother-in-law who is helping out with the bills. So just me working pretty much. And so, with our finances, we have to be extremely careful. We walk on a knife edge, pretty much, but we were doing okay. Um, so, June comes around, right? And the company switches to a different payroll company uh, called Paylocity. And with that, they offer a system called Pay On Demand, where you can get an advance based on hours you've already worked, but you can only do it once a month, up to a maximum limit. And so, pretty much, I did that the first month that was available. Um, it allowed me to get ahead on my bills. I mean, I was actually ahead, doing fine. Everything was great. Um, that goes for a few months, and then we get to December. And this is where, quite literally, the, the past couple weeks have just tore me down emotionally, mentally, in a way that I just, I don't fucking care anymore. Um, so, December comes around. Um, my coworker finds out that Paylocity's on demand isn't working properly. Um, it's supposed to show from the 16th of the previous month up to current date, but um, it's now currently showing from November 30th to current date. Um, the problem with that is that's over two weeks of hours that we've worked that are not showing on Paylocity for us to be able to have on demand to. So we've gotten our paychecks, bills come out, all that. I'm pretty much broke at that time. I'm okay to last maybe a week. I have to get to around December 7th before my next set of bills come out and everything like that. So, you know, I usually do the on-demand before that. Um, but December 1st, grandpa, uh, co-worker finds out that it is not working. Uh, December 3rd, I find out it's not working, and I go up to HR, ask them about it, all that. Um, my co-worker says that he had emailed our uh, person in charge of this stuff about it, and it hasn't gotten anything back. I have some emails and stuff to show you guys that are on my end here shortly. Um, so, you know, I, I start becoming worried. I mean, it's Christmas time. Not only do I have a couple of other bills that are going to be coming out um, around the 7th and around the, uh, the 13th that I have to worry about, but also Christmas presents. I mean, my children, I love them. I'll do anything on the planet for them. Um, and so, you know, I start asking what's going on, what's going on, and, you know, we get further and further along, and... Uh, December 7th comes around and I'm freaking out by this time because I know as soon as tomorrow hits that I'm going to have bills come out and my account's going to be negative about $200 or so. So, you know, I've been asking what's going on. It's a technical problem. We're going to have a meeting about it. I've emailed their manager. I've CC'd their manager. These are all the different excuses I kept getting over and over again. Um, and it comes around and boom, my account's a negative 200 the same day that they try and do one thing to help the situation, which is there's a maximum withdrawal limit of one time. So um, they allowed it to do it. I had 225 that I had worked up since the beginning of the month already that I could, you know, because it's percentage based, you can only do so much. Da, 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 da. So I took that, but it was too little too late. It hit my account. My account was already negative. I got $25 to that. So we get around to the, the problem keeps progressing, okay? You know, my account is positive. I use that to eat a couple of times, this, that, you know, get gas in the vehicle just so I can get to and from work. I eat lunch one day, first time I got to in over a week, because it's, just, like I said, knife edge. Um, anyways, rambling there. Get going, and uh, pretty much we get further down the line. It's now the 15th. It's still not fixed. 
my count's negative 300 again right now. My kids, even if I get the rest of it, I have to make it through the month. I have to magic Christmas somehow. Um, I won't eat lunch, that's for damn sure. Like, I'd be lucky to eat at home, honestly, because I'm now officially at that point where I'm just terrified to do anything, take anything that could potentially hurt my children out of this house. You know, and I, I told these people, I was like, you don't realize what you made me do. I had to sit down and tell my children that they're not getting a Christmas this year because my job fucked up and won't fix it. Like, no one's offered anything. They don't offer to write a check. They haven't offered cash. And I just keep getting excuses. We're working on it. We're working on it. We're going to deal with it. Like, seriously? And if for some reason, it's just my company, the people here that are getting fucked. Like... This is something my children will never forget. Do you realize that? You know how fucking bad that hurts as a parent? It's it's literally destroyed me. Like, I don't know what to do at this point. These are, if you want to take the time to actually look through. Um, these are the emails and stuff that I've got. I had my tooth removed. But I've... Remove the names, if you want to take the time. The only name that's in there of anything is just my name. I took the company's names out. Anyone I talked to whose names were through it, I took out. This is just showing you guys. I'm not kidding. Like, I, I'm fucked in this situation right now. I don't know what to do. I've scraped, scavenged, borrowed, sold everything I can. I just don't know what to do. So guys have any suggestions comments any ideas on what i should do let me know this is zero coming real shitty later